How would you like to create all of these drawings and put them together in a PDF in one go? That's what the publish command will do. Let's have a look at the publish command. This is Vectorworks, file on the menu bar, publish. So this is the publish command where you can publish sheets, you can publish saved views, this is a saved view here, you can publish worksheets. The way that it works is you select the items you want to print, let's choose those, click on the arrow, bring them across. I'm going to make these PDF. Under the options, I can choose whether to publish them as raster information or as vector information. Now that's a completely different movie uh, and I'll do that later. So you just go to the PDF, make it a PDF. I'm just going to publish it. No, don't want to save that as a set. Now you can save it as a set and you can have multiple sets set up. So for the client, for the contractor, for the building authority, version one, version two, you can set up sets and it makes it really quick to publish these. Save the file, choose a location. I'm just going to put it on my desktop and let's replace the one that I've already got. So Vectorworks is now running through publishing my drawings. So it has to update every viewport. If you've got a big project, it could take a little while. So go get a cup of tea. And when it's finished, there it is. There's my set of drawings. And you can see there they all are, all updated the way that I wanted. This is really quick and I use it a lot. One of the things I have done is to change my print keyboard shortcut, Command P. I've changed this to publish. So when I go to uh, my computer and I go, let's print, I can go Command P, brings up the publish, because I publish a lot more than I print. So that's a quick introduction to the publish command. If you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you're not already a subscriber, don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell icon so you get notified, because I publish about five movies a week. So if you don't want to miss any, don't forget to become a subscriber. Now, if you love these movies and you love the way that I teach, think about becoming a member of my website. We have webinars, five webinars a month. You can attend interactive webinars where you get a chance to talk to me, talk to the others. It's amazing. You get to learn information from everybody around the world. It's really cool. So thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next movie.